Hey guys, welcome to an Atlas video. I'd love to do some survival videos for you guys, but the official servers are absolute trash. I get like 255 ping and it's just unplayable. So I figured I might as well try and show you guys some stuff from the game and I've really wanted to check out all the creatures. So we're gonna be doing that here today, starting with the land creatures and boy oh boy, there's so many really cool ones. So um, I just wanna mention that when I say every creature, I mean pretty much every creature. There's some like the chicken for some reason. I can't get the chicken to spawn. I'm trying my hardest, but it just won't happen. So things like that, like some of the creatures that I can't get spawning, they're not major things. They're kind of like tiny little creatures like tuna and chickens and stuff that they're really not even important. So we're gonna be checking out every single creature. I don't know much about these creatures. I wanna state that first of all, because the game literally just came out and this is my first time seeing some of these crazy creatures. So we're just gonna be taking a quick look at everything here and there's so many that I won't even be spending too long on each creature, except for the penguin because the penguin is amazing. Make sure you guys hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. And how amazing is this? You can hug penguins. But what's even better, uh, let me let me hop on something. You can hug penguins and ride on other creatures. It's the most amazing thing ever. <laughs> so I don't know the penguin's actual purpose in the game, but I think it's just, its purpose is to be adorable. It's absolutely fantastic. <laughs> Look at this thing. So you just hug them, it's fantastic. Uh, right here we've got a rattlesnake. Cannot uh, ride on this obviously, and you can't pick it up or have it wrap around you but uh, it's pretty cool looking. Right here we got a seagull, you can pick these up, you can tame them I do believe. And they're, they look kind of pudgy. <laughs> Let's chuck him over there. Uh, we've got rabbits, you cannot pick them up, uh, but I do believe that they are tameable. And they've got massive ears. It looks more like a hare to be honest with those ears. Uh, we've got monkeys, of course you can tame and pick up monkeys and whatnot and they're pretty adorable as well. You know, chuck him over there. We've got parrots, parrots are really cool. These actually look really nice. Man, if I was looking for a shoulder pet, I'd probably want a parrot. Uh, let's chuck him over there. There's also a crow, which is interesting. Another creature for your shoulder. This one's really nice, actually. It's got really nice colors. And then finally, we have the vulture, and you can pick him up. It looks pretty similar to the vulture from Ark, but uh, like in terms of its body shape and everything, but of course the texture and the color and everything is way different. And I don't know their exact purpose besides just sitting on your shoulder. So for this video, we're gonna pick up a parrot. Why not? So right here, we have got some rideable creatures. We've got the sheep, which just looks exactly like an Avis, uh, except obviously its texture is a little bit different. And I assume, obviously, this is the female. So you can get the male one, it has the, uh, the horns, the ram. Right here, we've got a bear. It handles pretty much the exact same as a dire bear in Ark. And for some reason, when I do this attack, I, I go out of third-person mode. But, you know, you can just see it's the claw. And then this is the stand-up kind of roar thing. Pretty much the exact same as the bear from Ark. But that's okay. I mean, like, the bear from Ark handles pretty well. Right here, we've got a cow. It is not rideable, but I do believe if you have buckets, you can milk them. And there's also a bull variant, uh, which I actually need to spawn in. Hmm. We'll check that out in a few minutes. Right here we've got the pig, pretty freaking amazing looking. The tusks coming up like that look really cool, but I'd be a little bit afraid that they're gonna grow right into his brain and kill him. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know if they keep growing throughout his lifetime, but he's gonna die pretty soon because they're getting pretty close. But uh, it's really nice, I actually really like the model of this pig. It's so cool, it's more like a wild pig rather than just a pig. What is it actually called? Yeah, it's just called a pig. Uh, right here we've got the crocodile. Dude, this thing looks fantastic, look at that. Really, really well done. I like it a lot. It looks way different from the, uh, obviously the Sarkos and Ark. Probably handles the same though. Feels like it kind of does. In terms of attacks, we've got this. Uh, right click does nothing, C nothing, X nothing. So yeah, and then obviously you can go in the water and move around fast in there. But I'm not going to show that off. Uh, I never showed off the attacks on the pig. Let's go ahead and do that. I'm just going to make sure I don't aggro that other one behind me. So yeah, he just has this attack. He doesn't do anything else. Uh, right here we've got an elephant. Pretty freaking amazing. It probably does the same stuff as a mammoth, I imagine, from Ark. Yeah, it seems like it kind of does. Yeah, I mean, it looks really cool though. I, I like the texture and the color and everything. The model's really nice and the tusks, dude, that looks fantastic. But yeah, uh, that is the elephant. We've got the giraffe here and I did not realize that giraffes could move so fast. Wait, let's see. There we go. We're kind of getting around. There's all these creatures. Oh god, what's happening? Everybody on passive. Let's kill this stupid thing. Can I? I can't kill the pig. Ah, run! <laughs> so, the, of course, the giraffe uses its head to attack, which is what giraffes do in real life. 
And, uh, whatever, I don't know what the hell this is. I think it's like a stompy attack or something. Am I even hitting this pig? I think I am. So, yeah, I really want to fight with a giraffe. Like, just hop onto somebody's boat with a giraffe and just clear the deck. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, this thing's really cool looking. You kind of float above it, so... I assume if they are tameable, which I'm actually not sure to be honest, some of the creatures it was hard to tell if they were or not. But uh, you might be able to put a saddle into him. So you're not floating above him. Yeah, you probably can tame them. Again, this just came out and like this is my first meeting of most of these creatures. Right here, right here we've got a wolf and it's probably the exact same as the dire wolf. Yeah, it seems to be. The dire wolf from Ark, of course. Uh, it doesn't have the sea attack, which is the sniffy thing. But yeah, it looks pretty cool though. I still like it. I mean, it looks slightly different with the uh, textures and everything on it, but the body and everything seems the exact same. Uh, right here, we've got the horse, completely different from the Equison arc. Very nice looking. Uh, so those are its attacks, and then it's got the C, which does that. The same animations as the Equison arc, but obviously it looks way different. And it's way faster as well, at least it seems to be. Oh man, let's put him back over here. Uh, we've got the, what is this, the lion? So I was actually riding on the lion earlier with a penguin in my arms, it was amazing. So this is C. What are we doing? Are we gonna roar? What? I don't know what this is. <laughs> okay. This is left click. Right click seems to do the same. Yeah, pretty cool. Obviously it's quite a fast creature. So yeah, uh, let's move on. We've got the tiger here, which it doesn't really look like a tiger to me. I guess it kind of does, sort of, but it's way furrier than I thought tigers were. Um, this has the same stuff as the Thyla from Ark, which is interesting. It even sounds like it. <laughs> now, again, like I, I know I'm saying that, that a lot of the stuff is the same as Ark, but I imagine eventually they're either going to like replace the models slightly, like alter them or replace the sounds. A lot of this stuff could just be placeholders, so you know, this is an early access game, you're gonna find things like that. Right here, what is this guy even called? Uh, I think he was called the Wild Rhino in the spawn command. So this thing looks fantastic. He's got giant armor plates all over his body. And those, he does, oh, is he hitting the rock? Are we gathering? I don't know if that's just a thing that he does. Oh, I think we were hitting that rock. We might be hitting the rock. Hard to tell. So he does that, and then right click does nothing, C, X, nothing. So yeah, this, this creature's really cool looking. And we've got the ostrich next. Oh, can I mount you? There we go. So this, this creature's really derpy looking. So left click, right click does nothing, C, X, nothing. But he does run pretty quick, and you can jump with them, which is nice. Their jump is really cool looking. They're also pretty fast as well. Alrighty. Oh man, we're making good progress here. I didn't want this video to be like a half an hour long, but it might end up being. Uh, right here, I spawned in a mermaid. I might just show you it on land. I'll show you it again in water. Um, very interesting looking. I kind of figured on land they might turn into like a sexy lady or something like that. I don't know. But uh, as you can see, it still has the tail. They even made a butt. <laughs> wow. Uh, right here, what is this actually called? I think it's just the Gorgon, yeah. But it kind of reminds me of like Medusa. I think Medusa is like a Gorgon or something, right? Uh, you're obviously not supposed to be able to tame these, hence why I'm sitting behind it here. But look at this thing. It's left click, right click, does some sort of projectile thing. C. Oh man, that is scary looking. So that stuns you, because that happened to me when I spawned this thing in. X does nothing, but yeah, that is really cool looking. Definitely one of the best looking creatures in the game, but uh, obviously these things are going to be really hard to kill because as well as being really awesome looking, they're super freaking fast. Could you imagine this thing like slithering at you? That would be terrifying. I am honestly terrified for when I come against one of these things because they could stun you for like 30 seconds. It's ridiculous. But yeah, very awesome looking creature. Um, I'm actually going to quickly, oh my god, can I even get out? going to quickly set the time today. Oh my god, I can't type. There we go, cool. Uh, right here, we've got the Cyclops. Super freaking crazy looking. So, left click is this. Right click. Kind of roars. Oh god, he's charging. <laughs> I did not think that was gonna happen. All right, C, does that do something? Oh wow, okay. 
and then X does nothing. Wow, the Cyclops is super awesome looking. He's got a little uh, cloth skirt thingy going to hide his junk. Super amazing. Wonder, I'm curious. Okay, yeah, I, I figured. <laughs> I figured they wouldn't put something there. Um, right here we have, why are you out of line? I don't even know. This is called, what is it called again? Shield horn. So this is essentially a trike put into the game made to look really different with feathers and everything, but it has the same animations as the trike. As you can see, the trike from Ark, of course. I'm not gonna do like the full of charge attack, but yeah, you can see it right there. So that's one of the three that was just refeathered and whatnot. This is basically a Tranodon refeathered. As you can see, it's called a leather wing. So C does this, it's the exact same as a Tranodon. And then you can pick things up. Although that pickup animation looks a lot better. Let's wait for some stam. We can try that one again. Is that stam gonna come back? Yeah, kind of. There we go. Let's see that pickup animation. That looks a little bit better than the Trinodon, actually. I like that. That's cool. So yeah, um, it's kind of a nice looking creature. I mean, it definitely looks a little bit better than the Trinodon from Ark. They like redid the head slightly, but the body and everything is pretty much the same. And then right here we have the Uteranus put into here, and it's called a Razor Tooth, I think. Yeah, Razor Tooth. So then this is its left click, right click. <laughs> uh, we've got C. Yeah, exact same as, as the Uteranus from Ark. And then it doesn't do anything for X, I don't believe. Um, but yeah, that is... Oh, my dude on my shoulder is all boosted. That is the Razor Tooth. And it even does Courage Roars and stuff. Man. Uh, right here, we've got a bunch of creatures. I'm going to just have to show them off briefly. Uh, pretty much just the giant bee from Ark put into here. It looks a little bit different on its butt. Or thorax, I think that's what it's called. Um, we've got a scorpion. For some reason, I'm able to ride this. I imagine they're not tameable, so you can't do this. Uh, we've got a giant ant. Probably not tameable. Not rideable, anyway. We've got a giant spider. This thing looks fantastic looking. Ignore the little glow thing on them. You can ride them. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to tame them, though. So, yeah. Uh, that is it. And then we've got a cave bat, which is not rideable. And it looks it looks a lot different than the onyx from, from Ark. So, like, it le at least in the face it does, anyway. I'm not sure about the rest of the body. But, yeah. So, that's just a bunch of creatures there. We've also got a snake as well, actually. I never showed this dude off. He looks super cool. I'd love to be able to show you proper animations, but I can't ride him, so... But yeah, you can see him right there. He's it's kind of like a, a cobra with the, uh, what's it called, a frill around his neck there. Really cool looking. Um, moving on, we have the drake. This thing is so cool looking, but they are a temporary tame. You can have them for like six hours. So, wow, it took me an hour to set up this whole video. GG. All right, so these things are fantastic looking. I love the, the model and everything. It's really cool. So it's left click. Right click is breath. C does nothing, X does nothing. You can, of course, fly with them. They handle pretty well. They've got quite a large turning radius, of course. You can do the breath in the air. You can bite. I have this fire elemental following me because he was, like, going all over the place for some reason. C and X does nothing, and Control does nothing as well. But it's a really awesome-looking creature. And I imagine that they're, like, a top-tier tame because you're not supposed to be able to have them for very long. Um, next, I guess I'll show off this fire elemental who is very keen to get into the shot here we go so here he is uh let me the camera is really wonky with this dude you're probably not able to tame them so that is that is left click right click probably is the fireball yeah that is so cool looking that animation wow that is awesome and then c throws a little mini fireball kind of like flower power and then X does nothing. So yeah. These guys are of course like mini bosses, I think. Oh god, I'm on his head. Ah! <laughs> Ouchie. My knees. Uh, what are you? Are you just a seagull? Okay. Just making sure I didn't mess something. Right here we have a rock elemental. So of course we have these in arc, but this is way different from the arc one. As you can see, it's kind of held together using some mystical forces. Uh, that is left click. It attacks really fast as well. Right click probably throws a rock. So yeah. Pretty much the exact same as the one from Ark. Yeah, exact same animations. But that's okay. I mean, this thing looks really cool. 
Um, so I think that it, I think that does it for like all the land creatures that I could spawn in. I'll spawn in the Hydra later on. We'll check out some water creatures and then we'll check out the Hydra, which is like obviously a giant five-headed dragon looking thing. Really crazy looking. So I'm gonna, you know, I think I have some water creatures spawned in, but they keep getting killed. So I have to, I have to go ahead and uh, delete them. I think, yeah, it looks as if they've all gotten killed again. Alrighty, well, we'll be back in a second and we'll check out some water creatures. Okay, so I might as well just show them as I spawn them in because they're, they're just gonna keep, like, going really far away or else not getting tamed. So this is the shark. It's essentially a hammerhead shark, if he'll come back to me. Awesome. These things look fantastic. Let's go up here. So as you can see, look at that freaking face on them. Crazy looking. Really, really nice. I love the model. It's massive as well, which is cool. Like, giant sharks are really awesome. As you can see, the, the waves are, like, going up and down, so I'm, like, kind of going under a little bit. <laughs> but, yeah, this thing, I, I don't know if they are actually tameable, but they are terrifying because they're so fast. So, does right-click do anything? I'm not sure if it does anything. Where is the coast? Is it back this way? Oh my god. Oh, wow. Okay, no. <laughs> I got turned around a lot. All right, that's not good. So yeah, that is the shark, hammerhead shark. Really cool looking. You can beach them as well, which is something I did a lot earlier. <laughs> he just like turns upside down. Can we get into his mouth? No, we can't. <laughs> All right, so let me see. What's the next one that I know I can spawn in? I know I can spawn in the squid. QID. And I think, yeah, these guys are force tameable, but I can't ride him, but I can get him to follow me. Which is obviously not going to be the best, but, you know, I think I can get him to follow me anyway. Is he going to follow me? No, he doesn't want to follow me, but he's going to fight some stuff. So you can see him there. These are obviously not tameable. It's the exact same animations as the Tuso, apparently. Which is okay. I mean, the Tuso animations are really good. But yeah, that is, <laughs> that is the squid. He's just gone forever. We're never going to see him again. Um, I can't spawn in the Marlin, which is obviously like a swordfish. I don't know why, it's just some creatures, like for some reason the names just don't work and then I go into their folders and like the files look different from the from like most of the other creatures. So I can't really do that. Uh, gentle Whale, let me see if I can spawn him in. Yeah, Gentle Whale is his name, I assume. Whale. There we go, oh my god he's massive. Okay, oh I can ride on him. Probably not able to tame these. Kind of just looks like, I think that's the face of like a blue whale. <laughs> looks so cool. That's left click. Right click does nothing apparently. C does nothing. Okay, cool. So yeah, that is the gentle whale. It's a very large creature. But uh, of course, these are just going to be like a, uh, a passive whale in the water that will not attack if you attack it. It's just going to try and get away from you, obviously. So yeah, pretty cool. That's really nice as well, but uh, okay, he's gone. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, let's see what else we got We've got the mean whale, which I assume is gonna eat my face Mean whale, oh my god, how big are you? Ah! Is this the exact same? Wait, let's look up directly. Okay. No, this guy's way different. All right. He just looked the same from up above. Oh wow Look at those teeth So that is I don't know if right click does anything C does nothing from what I can tell. These are probably also not tameable, but they're going to attack your boat and be really mean because they're a mean whale. Very nice looking though. I like how you bounce right back up in the water. Like if you're close to the surface, it just bounces you back up. <laughs> All right, what else we got? Um, there is also another whale. Let me see. What's he, what's he called? Sea monster whale. Spawn him in. Ah, I don't think I can spawn him. All right, here is the manta ray. I believe I could force tame these guys, but they move pretty quick, so it's gonna be kind of hard to do. But it's pretty much the exact same as a manta in arc. Probably not gonna be able to force tame them. <laughs> you can also ride on them, but they're probably not tameable. Yeah, I can't seem to get them. <laughs> it's just so fast. All right, yeah, no, I'm not gonna try and attempt to get them, but yeah, you can see them there. It's pretty cool looking. Here is the jellyfish. You can also force tame them, but I'm not gonna bother because uh, he might be easy actually. No, I got him. There we go. He's on his side now. They do the electricity thingy. Uh, next, we've got an Atlas eel. Atlas. Oh. Atlas eel. Pretty much the exact same as the eel from Ark. 
Of course, just reskinned a little bit. I can't, I can't get him. <laughs> I got him. There we go. Where's he? Go? Oh, he's. I don't. Where? Where did he go? I have no clue where it's gone, but you you saw it there for a second. <laughs> so hard to show things in this game. Uh, and then next we've got the Kraken, which I assume is the boss, and. You know what? Yeah, we might as well just see if we can spawn him in. <laughs> I don't know if I'm able to. No, I don't think I'm able to spawn him in. He might have a different spawning uh, code. I did type that right, didn't I? Yeah, I don't believe he's spawnable. Oh, there we go. Oh, there he is. Force team. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god, this thing's massive. Look at this. Holy crap. <laughs> Giant! I don't know how big this is compared to creatures in Ark, but you can see me on the back of that tiny dot. You see me? Yeah. <laughs> oh man, I'm like tiny compared to it. So let's see. Uh, left click and right click do nothing. Oh, right click does fire apparently. Wait, why is he pointing that way? Can I get everybody to look forward? All right, so let me see. C. C looked like it was doing something. I don't know what C does. X? X is the poison. Uh, Z? No. Um, R? Control? It looks as if they're about to attack, but I'm not exactly sure. N, M, no, I just pulled out a map. Uh, T, R, E's gonna dismount me. Q? I have no clue. <laughs> all right, let me see. Uh, it's the, there's no, there's obviously no instruction manual with this thing, but I imagine all of the attacks are manageable. X was poison, right? Right click is fire. Still pretty cool so far. Uh, left click. Oh, left click's gonna do something. Left click is lightning. All right, I didn't even see that earlier. That's cool. All right, so uh, does anything else happen? P. Oh my God. Control. Alt. Spacebar. I feel like spacebar should do something. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just gonna start mashing a bunch of buttons. Oh, that's gonna open up my inventory. Okay. L. J's gonna whistle follow, so I shouldn't do that. H. No. G. I don't know what that is. Uh. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I don't know. I. I. How many did we get so far? We got three. Fire. Poison. Lightning. Now, there's supposed to also be like a blinding one, and then I think there's an ice one as well. But yeah, I can't figure it out. Um, I imagine we'll be checking out this guy eventually again, but I can't figure him out, so... Yeah, no. <laughs> anyway, guys, I... Oh, God, I have my map out? Are you kidding me? Man. Anyway, I think that's gonna be it for today. We've checked out pretty much every single creature in Atlas, and they are all really awesome looking. There's obviously some similarities, but it doesn't bother me because this game is about the ships, not really about the creatures, and uh, the ships are something that we have never seen before. But anyway, if you guys have enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit the like button. Which one of these creatures is your favorite? I am really digging the Drake. I really like the, uh, I actually really like the Razortooth as well, and I love the Penguin, of course. Let's go hug him before we end this video. Me, I, I gotta, I gotta go hug that penguin. It's the only thing, the only thing that matters in this world. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. <laughs> anyway, uh, if you guys want to see some more Atlas gameplay, I plan on doing tons of videos with some of my buddies here, and uh, I'm really excited. If you guys are too, subscribe, put on the notifications and whatnot, and we'll see you then. Look at me, I'm just, my head is buried into this little penguin. <laughs> Love me.